Being scratching an itch. Shining moment getting two to one play, as Chad mentioned. Gouda man, one that's getting his fair share of attention, too. They're set for a start. Often pacing, and from the far outside, Shining Moment gets activated early, leaving from the inside the tandem of Connor B and scratching an itch. Center of the racetrack, there's Guduman. He's just going to survey the situation there in float mode for McDonald. Backed off into fifth goes Wicked Storm. Then sixth to the rail is Lions Frankie J. Backed up seventh goes Bruno. No, no, no. Winchester Phoenix racing along next to last, and Bunko's boss can see them all. That first panel stepped in 27 and 4, and into the back stretch now they'll chase. Shining Moment. Shining Moment, the maker of speed, sent off as the favorite leads the way just over a length. Scratching an inch is in for a beauty of a pocket trip there, mapped out by Henry. Three lengths back to Connor B. Gouda man on his back from in fourth. Then three lengths gapping back into fifth goes Wicked Storm. Lions Frankie J, the sixth one. Further back we go to Bruno, no, no, no. Two more lengths back inside Winchester Phoenix and still the trailer Bunkhouse Boss. Single file through a 55 and 3 half back to back 27 and 4 panels and it's Shining Moment leading into the final turn on top just over a length. Scratching an itch in that pocket spot. Third to the outside, started up Connor B though he's right back down to the pylons there aborted that first over attempt so Guduman is left on covered here. Henry's going to sneak to the outside though with scratching an itch. Three quarters in 124 and it's game on. Still there shining moments but here comes scratching an itch. Scratching an itch on the outside. Scrambles to the front now. Down the center shining moment. Connor B shoots up the inside with late pace. From the backfield a sideways Bruno. No, no, no. He's powering up late now and Bruno. No, no, no on the far outside. Sweeps by them all. It's Bruno. No, no, no to win. Second best in the center, Wicked Storm in 153 and 1. Scratching an itch, scratching an itch on the outside, scrambles to the front now. Down the center, shining moment, Connor B shoots up the inside with late pace. From the backfield, a sideways, Bruno, no, 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 he's powering up late now, and Bruno, no, 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 on the far outside, sweeps by them all. It's Bruno, no, 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 to win. Second best in the center, Wicked Storm in 153 and 1. Here's a look at the winner of tonight's third, to Victory Lane. It's number four, Bruno, no, no, no. Two-year-old son of all that soft, out of the real artist mare, win back Alice. Owned by Jeff Corshane, Mart West Racing Stable, and Tony Arts, Gabby Sasso, the trainer, Bob McClure, the winning driver. Bruno, no, 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 in his third career try, picks up a maiden-breaking score tonight. As he takes down 